flurry of roster moves for the Cardinals, who send Matthew Libertor out for his season debut, and that totally reshapes the Cardinals' starting rotation. Yeah, it certainly does. Right now, the thought is to go with a six-man rotation, and a great opportunity for Matthew Libertor, an opportunity that he earned. He was throwing the ball so well at AAA. We saw him last year, appeared in nine games, started seven of them. Strike three, 96 in a paint job. Good start for Libertor. One up and one man down. Mentioned his fastball has always been good. Ali said it's a different looking pitch. Maybe that's an example. Little roller slowly hit towards short. And that peg to first is in plenty of time for out number two. Swing and a miss. How about that start? Three up, three down. And about 12 pitches. Welcome back to the show, Matthew Libertor. The Cardinals go to work versus Corbin Burns. Corbin Burns as tough as they come. Three straight quality starts for him. He's four and two on the season. The league hitting just 204 against him. And the lefties have been sawed off, hitting 148. And a good at bat for Goldschmidt. Got to two strikes, earns a walk. As Nolan Gorman is your hitter, riding a seven game hitting streak. And that one hammered in into right field off the second baseman's glove. Goldschmidt around second. He's on his way to third. Gorman roasts that baseball for the first Cardinal hit. And the Redbirds in business. First and third with one out. Next RBI for Arenado will be number 1,000 in his big league career. This would be a great spot to get it. On the ground. That slowly hit toward third. Bobble and everybody's safe. And the Cardinals take the lead. Well, there it is. RBI number 1,000 for Nolan Arenado. What a milestone that is. Been one of the most dominant players in the game since he showed up. The crowd is seeing it on the Jumbotron here. They're getting a great round of applause. Third primary third baseman since 1920 with 300 or more homers, 1,000 or more RBIs before 1,500 career games. And a guy coming to the plate in Joey Weimer, Josh, that is really doing a good job against left-handed pitching this season. Brewers looking for a clutch two-out hit from him right here. Swing and a miss. Libertor some two-out trouble, but strikes out his third man. Matthew looking sharp, shut down inning. Cardinals look to add to a 1 0 lead. Edmonds, seven hits against Milwaukee in the first two games. He's riding a five game streak as well. Right back where it came from. Edmonds got a six game streak. So good production out of the nine spot. And Newt Barr will be the batter with two outs. Let's see if the Cardinals think about running here with two outs. You've got your leadoff hitter, Newt Barr, in the box. Runner goes. Pitch a strike, throw to second, not. Good play by. Adamas to keep that from sailing into center and Edmund says not my first rodeo he'll stand at second with two outs Burns who gave up a run in the first trying to put up a zero in the second and new bar hits ground ball to second to Rang takes care of new bar the inning is over to a base hit by Edmund that is all Miller struck out looking to start the game for Milwaukee. Owen Miller down the left field line that'll be extra bases for the Brewers leadoff man. Second hit this time a double and Owen Miller is on base for a 19th consecutive game. Hit towards the middle but right at the second baseman Gorman. And he throws out Contreras. Miller moves up to third. Need a two out knock here from Willie Adamas. Adamas at 216 coming into play tonight. Back to the mound and up the middle. Long hop throw and the stretch. Got him what a play. Nolan Gorman saved a run. Gorgeous play up the middle. The base is empty, two outs. Taylor 0 for 1. He flat out to Burleson and left. Tyrone Taylor out towards left center field. Back Newt Bar still back. Warning track. It is gone. We are tied. Tyrone Taylor got it up over the fence. Pause for just a moment as Malachi Moore signals Homer and Tyrone with his second of the season. They're going to look at this potentially. I don't think this got out of the ballpark. So it doesn't go into the stands. It ricochets back onto the field of play. It's a boundary call. So the crew chief will take a peek at this. After the review, the call on the field is overturned. The ball was in play. The runner will be placed at second base. So it's a double, not a home run. Let's see if Matthew Libertor on a humid day can leave him there at second with two out. Breaking ball frozen strike three and Libertor gets out of the fourth inning. Donovan might have broken his bat before grounding out in the first inning. So he's up for the second time. Over the mound might be trouble near collision ball drop. Everybody's safe. 
Oh, that had trouble written all over it once it skipped over the hill. Donovan has a hit, and the Cardinals are in business with nobody out. So Burleson's got to move the runners up after the infield hit. Shows Bunt, Bunt's it past the mound. Tarang another try. That's not in time. Everybody's safe. Back to back infield hits, and they're loaded with nobody out. Just like everyone in the ballpark was expecting, the Burley Burleson drops down the drag button, ends up getting the knock. And Tarang's got to be saying, can they run something except the option? They're trying to run him over at second base. Base is loaded and nobody out. Paul DeYoung, your hitter. Got him. Instead of climbing the ladder, he throws one right at the knees. One gone. Got him. Three straight curveballs, and he puts away Tommy Edmond. This is why this man has won a Cy Young Award. There is no situation that scares Corbin Burns, but he's not out of the woods yet. Cardinals have done good work with two outs. Need Newt to lift us. Banks is loaded. Out in front of home plate, Caratini picks it up, throws the first, got him. Let's go. There's that primal scream that Chris Hook was talking about before the game today. Really a terrific job. Libertor, you could not have asked for more from him. Every other inning, he retired the leadoff batter, but a terrific job, and he should get a nice round of applause as he exits. As he talks it over with the veteran Adam Wainwright. Waino all smiles, happy with the performance. You know Libby would love to be able to finish that sixth inning, but what a performance it was as we take a look at Andre Pallante in for his 13th game of the year. Pallante is excellent against lefties. Caratini is choosing to hit left-handed here. Let's see how it plays out. First and third in a one nothing game. He got him, swing and a miss. The Brewers strand two more in the sixth. Libertor in the lead, one nothing in St. Louis. Wainwright has made the call, okay? So this is a burger phone. These guys are calling homers left and right. When the phone is open, that means somebody dialed it up and called a homer. And it sits in front of whoever called said homer. So look, Wainwright's on the call here. Fly ball center, Wiener going back, still going, track, wall, she is gone forgiven it's three to nothing not sure who had this call on the burger phone chip but it's a good call here with Paul DeYoung talked about jumping on the cutter old saying you used to dial nine for long distance that was the number punched into the burger phone here for the Cardinals in the six Miller's been a pest he's doubled he's walked he's also struck out and a line drive to left, a base hit. The tying run's going to come to the plate now in the form of William Contreras. A couple of knocks by Winker and now Miller, who's been on base three times. Popped him up. Donovan foul ground, plenty of room. He's got that. So there's out number two. And Willie Adamas is 0 for 2 and stands in. He comes set with a 1-2. He got him, swing and a miss. The Brewers strand two in the seventh. We stretch in St. Louis. Cardinal Nation enjoying a three-nothing lead. And here's Miller. Got to figure out how to get this guy out. He's reached base now in 19 straight games. He's got two more hits in this one. And a ground ball through the left side. Just shortened up. 98 mile an hour fastball and just like that the tying run coming up. Owen Miller keeps swinging it. His third hit of the game. Fourth time on base. Never know now. Six hits in the series for Owen Miller as Contreras is at the plate 0 for 4. Strike three. Pull the string on it. That's a lot to cover isn't it? Well two pitches ago got away with the backup slider. This one the perfect slider at 89 miles an hour. It's right there on the corner to get the punch out. And now the Cardinals are one out away from their third straight series win. Little pop towards short, and that's going to do it. Cardinals win the series. They shut out Milwaukee and pick up another game in the Central Division race. The Cardinals knew they had a tough task going up against Corbin Burns, but Matthew Libertor gets the victory. He matched him pitch for pitch. Paul DeYoung with a big swing of the bat to make it 3 nothing, and the Cardinals' bullpen made it stand up. What a series it was for the Redbirds.